Okay, find the limit as x approaches 0 of sine of 5x over x. And before we even get started, I will remind you of something we'll take as a given. We know that sine of x over x, the limit of that as x approaches 0 is equal to 1. Okay, so what do we do here? Well, we're going to get started by just multiplying top and bottom by 5. So I have 5 sine of 5x over 5x. Great. Now, of course, I want to make this look like that as much as possible, essentially. So I'll take the 5 out. I can just do that because we're multiplying this. So I can just take out the constant and go 5 times the limit as x approaches 0 of sine of 5x over 5x. And um, now what can I do? Well, I'm going to just say that 5x is equal to y. Okay? So we're going to have sine of y over y. Now, here we have x approaching 0. So it follows that, observe that, observe, observe that. If 5x is equal to y, as x approaches 0, y will approach 0. Does that make sense? If, after all, if we plug in a 0 here for x, we're going to get 0 for y. So, great. So we got 5 times the limit as y approaches 0 of sine of y over y. So this corresponds directly to what we had here. And that's just equal to 1. The whole thing. So we just have 5 times 1, which is 5. That's it.